Gear TV. I'm Josh. That's Ben. And uh, today um, we're going to be talking about a special product, a beer koozie, but not just any beer koozie. This beer koozie's got an X strap. It has an X strap. And we're both wearing one. And this koozie comes from our sponsor for today's video. We've talked about the uh, the sponsor before. They're yeah. getting at us for one more video, floatripper.com. Mm -hmm. These are some koozies they sell. Yeah. And believe it or not, there's not a whole lot of people who sell the koozies with the next trap. I think Gary is real disappointed about what just happened. Can we take a break for a second? Yeah, go ahead and get him situated and then we'll get... That's what I get for messing with him. Get back to the... He's gonna be pissed. Okay, so anyways, yeah. this isn't going to be real long or in-depth, but nonetheless, we were taking a look around. Not a lot of koozies with neck straps. No. And a couple reasons why this can be good. If you're floating on, yeah. your, on your camping trip, it's really, really good because you're able to uh, you know, keep yourself afloat. you got something to keep your drink in, right. and it's not going anywhere. It's hung around your neck. Yeah, I mean, when you're canoeing down the river... Um, generally, I paddle with two hands. I think most people do. And then I have a tall boy of bush in my koozie with a neck strap. Mm -hmm. So I got I got no problems paddling, paddling. Right. You know, when I'm not paddling, I'm drinking. It's lots a lovely of, thing. Lots of people I see sell koozies mm -hmm. with no neck strap. Bunch of bitches. Right. And see, man, do I have to bleep that out? I don't know. I hear people say it on the radio. Yeah, that's true. And I guess they see it on you. I guess you could say that word on my television. We'll have to air this video after nine o'clock. Yeah. So, um, but with all those other koozies that are out there, they're, I'm sure they're fine products and worth for keeping your drink yeah. cold and your yeah. hands warm. Yeah. But no neck strap. And some koozies that I've seen are kind of thin. Yeah. I mean, they're thin like. The barely thicker than underwear, maybe. Sure. And yeah. they're like, I don't know what the point of that is at all. I mean, it's these these things are pretty sturdy. What do you think that is? Like a half inch of yeah foam. Foam. Uh, yeah, it's real thick. Yeah. Um, this flexible foam thing. Exactly. I'm not sure what the technical yeah. term is, but I think foam thing is pretty yeah. close. Yeah. So you can buy these at FloatTripper.com, and um, you know they sell them with their logo on them. Uh, they sell some plain ones, um, and then they also sell custom orders, and you can get your own graphics or your own logo put on them for an event or what. Yeah, what I've have seen. You. you know, a lot of times maybe somebody's having a big reunion and they're doing a floating or camping or some sort of hiking trip or yes. something like that. Yes. And you know they can order, you know, yeah. forty or maybe your group is not that big and you need ten, but whatever. I don't know. Yeah. You can order whatever you need from them, but the. Um, yeah. Boy, I wanted, what was I was going to say? Oh, they have free shipping on all their orders. Free shipping. And they, so the price is actually an adjustable price on their site. Yeah, the price is uh, $6 um, if you buy one or two. Right. Uh, but again, it's free shipping. And then it moves up, or the yeah. price lowers as you move up. I think it's five bucks a piece if you buy three or four of them, and then if you buy five or more, they're four bucks each and free shipping. Oh, and I noticed another thing. That, first of all, the strap comes off yeah. through this Velcro, and then it just slots through the side. There's a hole on the bottom, and you can mm -hmm. play little fun games with your friends, like I Spy, and you can pretend you're a pirate. Yeah. You can do that. If you have huh. two, you can act like you're wearing binoculars, huh. or, or you're an alien, perhaps. Who would have known? And, I mean, the hours of entertainment yeah. that come from these, right? well worth the $6, even if you just buy one. Now, is the game I Spy... Is that like the game Just the Tip? Uh, I believe there are different rules for I yeah. Spy. Um, that would be something we'd have to Google and look up specifically, maybe in a later right. episode. All right, fair enough. Um, yeah, so if you play the I Spy game this way, mm -hmm. you know, maybe I think the fun game for this is try to look through the hole and see who's going to hit you in the face. Oh. So mm -hmm. there's a lot of games that can be played. Yeah. Um, not sure how just well, the tip This works, episode's so really going downhill, so uh, <laughs> we better get out of here. We'll see you next time. Camping Gear TV. Look at her. She's a bad man.